This tutorial is meant to teach you how to copy your information from one Blackboard course into a new Blackboard course. To get started, you need to be enrolled as an instructor in both classes. In this case, my example class is my old class, Elizabeth's Dev course, and my new class that has nothing in it, my second Dev course. We like to think about course copying as a push rather than a pull. In this case, we are going to select our old class that already has all of our information in it. You can see on the left that I have announcements, I have syllabus, course reading, assignments, exams, all of these things that I want to pull over, or push over rather, to the new class. To get this process started, I need to go down to Packages and Utilities, and then select Course Copy. Make sure that Select Copy Type is on Copy Course Materials into an existing course. After you have that chosen, go ahead and click Browse to select the class you want to copy into. Once you have that class selected, you can click the radial button and hit Submit. The next step is to select what you want to bring over. Most of the time, people want to copy all of their content into their new class. If you just want to bring everything over, just hit select all. If you want to bring just specific stuff over, you can click content areas, announcements, blogs, calendar, whatever you have created in your old class that you want to bring over, you can just pick those. In this case, I want to select the entire class, so I'm going to click on select all and just sort of skim and scan to make sure that I have everything selected. After you've chosen what you want to bring over, go ahead and look at the file attachments section. We recommend that you do copy links and copy content or copy links and copies of the content to bring that over. You want to make sure that your enrollments are not selected. You want to leave this one blank. If you do have this selected, you will be transferring your class enrollment from your old class to your new class. This is only used in very specific circumstances, so go ahead and leave that one unchecked. When you've selected everything that you want to bring over, click the Submit button. You're going to get a message saying that your copy, your course copy is queued. It does take a little bit of time for the servers to process this, especially if you have a very large class. If you go into your new class, you'll see that there's a message waiting for you next to it saying that something is being copied into it, and if you select it, you'll see that same message. If you are in your course, your new course, and you're waiting for your content to show up, you're going to need to manually refresh that. It won't automatically refresh when it copies over. To do that, you're going to select the um, address at the top of the screen and hit enter to have it reload. Once it's done, you'll see a message that says your course copy is complete you will see all of your content over on the left hand side in a similar order to what you brought it over but you'll also see the original syllabus and content from the new class too. You can go ahead and delete those if you want. Just make sure that you're not deleting the content that actually has stuff in it. Once you're finished with that, you'll see that you have all of your things in folders, just like you had set up in your old class, and you can go ahead and change it to suit the needs of your new class. Hopefully you found this tutorial to be helpful. If you need any further help with this, please feel free to give us a call or send us an email, and we'd be happy to help you out individually.